Hello, everyone. I am the Bill and it's Horse 3000. Now, Bill, what are you wearing on your head? Well, the zoom button is called a headset. Oh. Hey, now I am taking a look at a bunch of Minecraft mods created by iTron. This blue guy. This blue slime thing with a bandana on his head. Whoa. Beep. Now I looked at a couple of iTunes mods before like Morph, a Portal, a Gravity Gun, and yeah. And today we're looking at the smaller bits of iTunes. Uh oh. There's something wrong with the hat. The hat doesn't go all the way down to my head when I sneak. Uh oh. Beep. Hey, the first thing we're going to take a look at is hats. Just straight up hats. I think it's just called hat mod or something. Hats. Something. Something. Hey. Now, to get a hat, press the hat button, which is H by default, and you'll get this amazing thing. Boohoo. You'll get random hats aplenty. Something seriously odd about these hats. It's like not even synced up properly. That looks painful. Owie. Hey. It's like a whole nother player on top of another player. The heck? Beep. Now, there are six modes. The first mode is called Flea Mode. You can wear whatever hat, whenever, whoever. Well, not whoever, you ever. Wobbity boo, loppity da, slappity doppity boobity boo. Yay. Now, mode number two is called Locked Mode. All players must wear this specific hat. They're all forced to wear that mind-eating helmet thing. For the Metroid. Hey, Command Giver Mode is the third one. What hat you wear is chosen by people who can use commands. That is a... Uh, that is a... Uh, the fourth mode is called hat hunting mode. Now, if you want the hat, you'll have to kill the mob that's wearing it. Oh boy. Something is... Duh. Beep. Now the fourth mode. It's if you see a mob that's wearing a hat, if you kill it, you get its hat. Yay! Probably not the hat you're looking for, but... Whatever. Ooh. Okay. Now the fifth mode is called King of the Hat Mode. Only one shall wear a hat. The king has to defend the spot or lose the crown. I really wonder if King of the Hat Mode hat is a specific hat. Like a crown and not something wham boozily boozy boo or something or something and the sixth mode is called time active mode players unlock more hats the more time they are active on the server yay server stuff yay a lot of me babbling on about how how many modes there are for hats and whoa Beep. and now for the next mod this thing. What is this thing? Well, this is part of the sync mod. A little mod that came from Corridor Digital or something or inspired by Corridor Digital. No, woo. Hey, now here we have a shell constructor. You're going to need a thing called a sync core to make it. To make a sync core, you're going to need two daylight sensors, two nether quartz, two emeralds, one block of redstone, one ender pearl, and one lapis lazuli block. Yay! And you'll get a blue 
Ball of Doom. Hey, now to make a shell constructor, you're going to need a sink core, four obsidian, and three glass panes, and one red stone. Die! And you'll get this magic thing. Now, this thing in on itself won't work. Hang on, can you merge you? Ah. The moment I right click it, hey, hey. Why? Now, the shell constructor has extracted a little bit of my DNA by taking off a finger or something. I don't know. It's Minecraft. It, nothing is realistic. Day. It's all blocks. Beep. Now to get this thing to work, you're going to need three things. Or several things if you want things to speed up. Hey, the first thing you're going to need is a treadmill. To make a treadmill, you're going to need one daylight sensor, iron bars, two black carpets, two obsidian, and one redstone. And you plop it down like... Not like that, like this, and this, or this. So many treadmills. Hey, one of those mods. Hey, I'm gonna place my treadmills down like this. Hey, now if you place your treadmill down like this, and it's gonna be problematic or something. It's gonna be some future problems. So let's just put the treadmill right there. Now the second thing you're gonna need is a lead. It's a standard Minecraft lead. You're gonna need four string and a slime ball. Yay. Now, the third thing you're gonna need is a pig. It's a piggy, piggy, pigness. Now you use your lead to lead the pig onto the treadmill, or to the treadmill, and then you right, ugh. God, what is wrong with me today? Then right click the treadmill. Huh. It's working. Random white dots are appearing. Ah. Now to make this thing go faster, you're gonna need more treadmills and more pigs. Hey. Yay. And they will go 25, no not. They will go 5% faster. Or something. Hey. Yay. And look at it go. Very slowly. These pigs are twitchy. My god, man, the poor piggies. Hey. Now, since I'm in creative mode, I can just simply right click it again and whoop! It's me. Except I'm naked. And my head is... What's wrong with my head? What's wrong with my head? It's so big! Hey! Now, you made this thing. Cool. What do I do with it? Okay. Now first, now first of all, you can get rid of the pigs, because... The treadmills will start to smoke after a while, for some reason. And... Ta-da! You have an extra life in hardcore mode! Yay! Now, if I go jump in the lava... Mojito... La 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 blah 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 That didn't work. That didn't work as hope as I planned. I wasn't part of the plan. Piggy, you betrayed me. Hey, you told me it was going to work, but it fails horribly. Why did you betray me like that? Beep. Now there's two extra things that you need. A redstone block, a block of redstone, and a shell storage. To make this, you're going to need, God, these are expensive. One sink core, four obsidian, two glass panes, one block of iron, and one weighted, weighted pressure plate. Heavy. Whoa. I'm pretty sure shell storage units and that thing is way more expensive in hardcore mode. 
Now if I were to leisurely wander in here, what? What's this? Block pause x equals 427, 150, blah, 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 my soul went and my soul was in there, but then it went over here and ah, body stuff. Wah! Now you should have an extra life in hardcore mode. Woo! And here we go. Yay! Extra lives! Whoa! Or weird clones. Or magic clones where you don't have to do stuff. Amazing! Pig! Die! Darn it! Now the next thing we're gonna look at is the Morph Mod! Woo! Yay! Very early alpha version of the morph mod or morph mod whoa you can turn into any mob yay now in the original morph mod you had special abilities and other cool stuff whoa but in this version there is no abilities because I tune um, I don't know Trail mix. Go. Nom 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 nom. Thumbs. My vision is turning orange. Hey. Hey. Oh jeez. Woo! I'm fast. Oh god. I. I don't have any. Friction. Oh jeez. Eek. Eek. Like sliding on ice. Okay. Oh yes. Okay. Really finicky. Oh god. Okay. Let me see if I can. Oh jeez. I got. It. Okay. Cow. Bang. I just. Bang. Kaboom. Hey. Okay, piggy. Blamo. Kaboom. Blamo! How long does this last? Because the friction is driving me bonkers. Hey, now what will happen if I feed this stuff to a pig? Ah, oh, it's popping out rainbows! And it can fly! What? Okay then! Oh, It's just kamikaze down into the ground. Oh, the poor pig. Wait, I want a saddle. Give me a saddle. Here we go. Whew. Flying away. What the, what the heck is the pig doing in my butt? Ah-ha. It's really uncomfortable. Ah-ha, oh, God. Ah, oh, invisible. Ah, my butt. No, oh, God. Pig, stop. Ah, why? Ah, oh, my butt, butt. <laughs> My butt will never be the same again. Nah. Oh my god. Oh. oh my god, pig. Oh my god, pig. No. Blah. Beep. Well, that was exciting. And what will happen if I give this stuff to a cow? Mm. Nothing. Alright, now what will happen if I give this horse trail mix? Hi. Hey, and off we go. Woo. Oh god, he's leaving a trail of fire. Hey. Okay, uh. Oh jeez. Oh god. Oh god. Oh jeez. My microphone. What is going on? Eek. The horse is setting everything on fire. He's super fast. And he. Kinda destroys blocks, but not really. Oh jeez. This horse needs to be put down. 
अगर अगर एक ओके दैट्स अनफ हॉर्सिंग अराउंड होली फी मोली इट इवन सेट द वाटर ऑन फायर हाउ डू यू सेट वाटर ऑन फायर हाउ डू यू डू दैट व्हाट द हेक नो हाउ सम मॉड्स डिस्ट्रॉय ब्लॉक्स ऑल मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम they don't destroy blocks they just make them invisible or super glitch or something la hey here's a wolf and here's a bone pop don't it here we have a wolf boom here we have a dog ready dog if if flower hey hey now what would happen Ba. Ha. A bee bucket. Hey. Bleh. Behold. The bee bucket. Hey. I have turned my dog into an effective weapon. So long, cows. Hey. You will be eaten by the bees. Hey. Wow. Now if you want your dog back just simply pa. Ta da. Yay, and you got your little doggy back. Now big on. Yo, it fills up bees. Beep. Now what will happen if you name your dog Ichun? Wow. The dog becomes a flame through our way. Bleh. A not very effective one. Bleh. Just sets. It just simply sets mobs on fire. I like Bee Parker better. Here we have the torch gun. Now this is from the torch mod. Make this. You're going to need two planks of wood. Four iron ingots, one gunpowder, and one glass. And you will get. A torch blaster. Boop, boop. Hey, this will definitely light up the cave. Whoa! Bruh. Here we have a torch. Look it. Just put gunpowder underneath a torch, and boom. Now this on itself won't work. You're gonna need flint and steel. Whoa! And you got yourself a firework. Boom. Very anticlimactic, actually. And here we have the rocket propelled torch launcher. Make this. You're going to need one dandelion yellow, four iron ingots, one dispenser, one gunpowder, one obsidian, and one piston. And you'll get this beauty. Now, Bill, how do you get ammo for this thing? Well, how how did you guess that thing thing needs ammo? Oh, anyway, you're gonna need a rocket propelled torch. Duh. And you're gonna need eight torches and one gunpowder. Whoa! Rocket propelled torch. Kaboom! Oh, jeez. Yep, this will definitely light up your cave. Alright, get every little corner of this. Alright. Ugh. Ugh. Holy moody. So many torches. Oh god, I missed a spot. Okay, there we go. I got it. I got everybody down there. Okay. I got every little corner of this place. Okay. Now before I see it, before I see any missed spots, I'm going to get out of here before I waste my breath again. What's this? Trade a mixed pig something launcher. Ah. Make this you're going to need one pink dye for ironing it. 
Uh, basically the rocket propelled torch launcher, except for pink dye. And you'll get this thing. Now, Bill, how do you get ammo for this thing? I'm pretty sure you get one of those trail mixed high pigs and you shove it in there. Trail mix! Okay. Shove the pig. And he's gone. And if I just shove a. Oh, there we go! I just shove a regular pig into it. And that is how you get add on. Oh god. Okay. Uh, it slowly sucks the pigs in. That's terrifying. Hey. Pigtastic. How the heck do you make this thing? Alrighty, apparently they will make a neon pig launch. Alrighty, here we have the neon pig launcher. I have no idea how to make this thing. It's really confusing. This thing is in the crafting table, but blah 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 blah. Ah. Okay. Okay, that, that's not how you, never mind. Hey, apparently you're gonna need yellow, dandelion, orange, rose, a diamond, purple, light blue, dye, and a glass pane. Again, no idea how you make this thing. And you get neon piggies. They flow up in the door. They float up into doom. Okay, now if you listen closely. It's a neon piggy. Oh jeez. So many particles. Oh god. Now pigs are dying. Oh god. Oh. Oh, the poor piggies. Oh. And here we have the attachable grinder. This thing is dark. It's dark, man. Make it with four bricks, four iron ingots, and one redstone. You attach it to an animal. And you wait. Ta-da! Ah, this thing is gruesome. What it does is it grinds up the animal from the inside. Ugh. It gives you a lot more meat. Phone! Not now. Ugh. The touchable grinder gives you a lot more meat if you were to simply kill the animal. You'll have to torture it. Oh god. Oh no. Shut phone. Oh, God. That was probably Peter calling me. Telling me I'm a horrible human being. Hypocrites. Oh, my goodness. I right, hear you have instruments. Oh, God. Okay. Now, to make these, you don't make them. I just remembered you don't make these. You just... Find around the strongholds, dungeons, and you find them. Yay! You have accordion, acoustic guitar, banjo, blah blah doo. Now you can add your own instruments and stuff, which is really cool. And you can add your own music and stuff, but all of that garbage is actually kind of complicated. So I am not going to do that. I'm lazy. Dancing parrot. Do the boogie. And that. And those were just a couple of iTunes mods. Now I missed a couple of them because either they didn't work together with all of these mods combined or they're big enough to have their own video. In the description below. Alright, now thank you all so much for watching. Like, 
dancing parrots. I feel like dancing parrots. Thank you very much, like it. And I will see you in the next video. Very well, my people. Whoa. Oh my goodness, man. There's so much stuff. I should made so much stuff. All sort of flickering, it's driving me bonkers. Ah, wait a minute. Nope, that didn't help. There.